Hello and welcome to our next installment of Survive the Hunt. So hunt me today we have uh, Jens, Pointless Pistol. Next we have uh, Warburn, 88. Next we have uh, Dubter. Yeah, making a, making a sign. Uh, next we have Sam <laughs> getting tasered from Gumpy. <laughs> and last but not least we have Gumpy <laughs> giving a slow clap. Right, I'll just turn uh, names of our players off. Uh, so we have everything switched off in this. Uh, so we can't tell who are players and who are NPCs, non-playing characters. Um, we're going to be trying to blow up some uh, brightly coloured personal vehicles. The time is 4.30 and we're going to set off now. Right. The point in this is for me to try and last for 24 in-game hours, uh, roughly 48 minutes. Uh, I get a two minute head start, which is one in-game hour, so 5.30 those guys will be starting out. My first task is to blast it into the city, or as far away from the docks as possible. Uh, secure myself an NPC car, uh, change my clothes and start blending in. Uh, and then make a, a plan to try and start blowing up their vehicles. Uh, the hunter's job is to try and shoot me in the face or kill me. Uh, they have to alight the vehicles before they can commence shooting. And they are limited on the weapon wheel to pistols and shotguns. So I'm just going to make my way uh, into the city. Um, and see if we can secure ourselves a nice vehicle. So there are five vehicles out there uh, in different locations uh, dotted around Los Santos. Uh, the boundary today is the same as always so I can't just go right up the Palato Bay and hide up there. I mean, what would be the point in that? That would be a bit boring. Uh, there are buffaloes. That was quite brightly coloured though. I think that was an oracle. Uh, oh, there's a there's a carbon as well. So I am unlimited in what I can get in terms of in terms of NPC cars. Those guys, however, are limited to coupes and below. And what I did forget to do uh, is nick a Simeon vehicle and deliver it. Serious trouble, uh, huh? Hopefully that okay. will get rid of the co Oh, there's a co two cops going past there. Please don't give me. Oh. Right, we are just going to put my vehicle back. Uh, I, like uh, I did press X there. Right, that's uh, put my vehicle back so they don't know where I've been or where I am. I'm going to change my clothes and then we can get uh, underway. So let's see what we've got on this account. So we are on PS5 today. Um, it's the first time doing a Survive the Hunt on, on PS5. Oh, and we're underway. Right, those guys were set out half an hour ago, there or thereabouts. So half four, remember that, Barry. That's when you started. So the vehicle locations today, I will get them up on the laptop in a bit. Just uh, navigate this corner. Um, I'll need to take my hands off the controller for a moment. Right, there we go. Uh, so the vehicle locations are the casino, the court centre, um, the arena, Simeon's, and the pier. Right. So the usual method in securing a vehicle i.e. blown it up is for me just to chuck a sticky bomb on it and uh, blow it up we'll turn the radio off so we're not jigging about now in this i don't change my hairstyle uh, or my look at all uh, so it does make it easier for the hunters just if they do spot me in the car i mean it's very unlikely that they'd sort of just spot me uh, looking into cars because the majority of the time they are sort of blasting about at breakneck speeds. However, 
Um, they do use a tactic of blending in as well. Uh, so if they are blending in, you can see my character is pretty distinctive. Uh, what we are going to do is just uh, wind the window down. I don't want a car alarm going off around here, so go on, you go. We're going to arm a sticky bomb. Uh, eventually. Oh, damn. Like so. Oh, there's a car going up there. Right. So the quarter cent, as you can see there, there's only one road that goes up and down it. Oh, yeah. That was an exemplar behind me. I wasn't sure if that was dubbed a. Whew. Now, maybe I can take a sneaky route. Oh, car just spawned out of the uh, tarmac there. Yeah, so this quarter cent, I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to go for this first, because I'm I think by far and away it's the most difficult one and I'm going to come at it from the hills you stay there sir no thank you so we're kind of getting near to the north border of where we're allowed to go so this petrol station is uh, right no merry weather I'm rather busy right we're just going to cut across the grass just make sure Oh, we don't want to hit cars. But I don't think that was anybody. Right, there's a quarter centre just over to the left there. And right at the top is uh, Dubda's car parked in there. So what I am going to do is I'm going to try and navigate across here. Uh without being seen because there's only one road that goes up to it <laughs> and one road that goes down to it unless you come off road um, so it's over there you've just got to be really careful uh, with trees and rocks and various other hilly stuff oh this looks like oh a bit of a bump oh warburn's gone there uh, off radar must have hit the wrong option. Right, I can't see anybody. Uh, where is it? Yeah, it's over there. Right, maybe I'm better off just sort of going a bit further north and then down a bit. Yeah, that's the one road that goes up, up and down. Whoa, that was a bit of a a bit of a bump they could probably see me from here from the road rather so I've got to be careful now although I usually use uh, sticky bombs I can as long as I blow the vehicle up whilst I'm still in the vicinity right it looks pretty clear uh, now where's dub to put it so I don't know ah there it is just in the in the entrance there Right, let me see. Uh, so I can see it. I'm in the vicinity. I'm going to try and RPG this one. Yep, yeah, that's got it. Destroyed his vehicle. I did, however, forget to... Uh, cops turn a blind eye, but for whatever reason... Oh, yeah, I've got a star now. Ah, uh, damn. That was remiss of me. Right, if I stay out of cover, because they'll be diving up to the quartz centre, I would have thought. If I stay out of cover. Yeah, they can't see me from the quartz centre, I don't think. But I've got to be careful rejoining. Let me just go down here a bit. So I want to get rid of that star because I've just called the, the cop so that'll have a cool down period. Because I called the cop, uh, sorry, called Lester to get the cops off me. Because uh, this was a Simeon's vehicle. Oh, so I'm quite pleased with getting there. Uh, yeah, well, I 
think we're pretty clear here. Hold on, there's a car flying past there. Go on, we, we need the start to go before we go down the roads. Yep. Right, star's gone. We don't have the cops. So we can hopefully drop down. Uh, and hopefully there aren't any hunters around. This is quite a steep embankment. So I'm going to take it extra cautiously, he says. Right, and back on the road. Whew, right, one down. Four to go. Okay, we're only uh, five hours into it. So that was not not a bad one. Whoa, where are you go? Oh, right. We'll just check. Get yeah, radios off. So it it is a sort of bit of risk and reward in terms of the the kind of car I choose. So this carbon is ours, quite loud. It's probably going to get checked out if they do see it, or the hunter's looking a bit more closely at it, uh, rather than a, a car that's uh, like a dilettante or. Uh, you know, um, an Astro or something like that, a sort of run of the mill car, um, is much less likely to get checked out. However, if they do spot me because of my distinctive look, then uh, and hairstyle, then if I'm in a an Astro or something rubbish, it's going to be a lot less likely that I can actually get away. These cars are acting really weird. What the? What on earth is happening? It's like every car's just turned into me. Have I got a target on my head for NPCs? <laughs> Have the hunters flicked a, a special switch? So sort of every NPC get Barry. <laughs> is there a mod? <laughs> That's outrageous. That was crazy. That. Yeah. So if I'm in a faster car, though, it's more likely to get checked out and more noticeable uh, it's a lot easier if I do get in the chase to get away from the uh, from the hunters uh, we do have a rule in this where although the hunters are all limited to coupes and below um, once I blow up the third vehicle if I get that far they then can all get it's unlimited in terms of NPC cars so they can get in furnaces 9Fs whatever they want basically Okay, so that's a quarter centre down. I feel that's uh, the most difficult to get. We had to go around the houses and off the beaten track um, to stay incognito. But I think we did uh, really well on that one. I'm quite proud of it. Although I did forget to uh, cops turn a blind eye. But uh, hey, nobody's perfect. So you can go right at a red traffic light if you treat it as a stop junction. Okay, we're going to go for one, there's one at the pier, um, just at the edge of the pier, I think. And go for our second target. So yeah, like I say, if I get, uh, I'm blown up the third vehicle, if I get that far, then those guys, excuse me, just get a drink. Those guys can, uh, are unlimited then, in terms of the cars they can get. Is this like... I'll tell you what, I'm just going to go. Yeah, there's a few things that can give me away uh, in GTA to the other players. Um, I can't hold my brake lights on when the car's stationary. Uh, I mean, I can, but it doesn't spawn on the hunter screens. I can't indicate, it's just something I can't do. Um, and when I'm stopped at traffic, uh, or in an area, or any players in an area, there's more likely to be a higher build-up of traffic, NPC traffic, so that can give me away. So when the hunters see sort of large build-up builds up of uh, traffic, they will check cars out more thoroughly. Uh, the other thing is there's a prompt comes up, which is all a bit random about uh, impromptu race challenge, um, which you can't turn off, and it it, it sort of appears randomly. Um, I can get it on my screen if there's another player 
around uh, they could be two blocks away they they might may not get the notification so yeah they're the kind of things that can give me away so I kind of want to go up to the pier so we're going to change lanes there's nobody behind us it looks pretty clear uh, what time we want we're good for, good for time uh, we've got a sticky bomb ready now which is going to be the oh wow mind that NPCs normally change lanes quite late here so that hasn't spooked me too much right we're going to uh, call Lester and get cops turn a blind eye so we don't get the rosers again Hello. I forgot that one what can I do for you? so okay. we'll get uh, I think it's yeah three minutes of that got a sticky bomb ready now I think I need the I think I need to turn left here yeah I'm just gonna head left ah the cars over there Oof. right let's just go for it check if anybody's about Right, that's that, uh, that's that done. I'll tell you what I am going to do. I'm going to sneak her right down here. Whew, heart's got a bit now. Yeah, you wouldn't believe this game mode. It's, uh, I mean, we do survive the chase, and that's just sort of pedal to the metal. Absolute mayhem. I have my map off, but all the hunter, all the chasers have the maps on. In this way, everyone's got the maps off. It's a lot more... Whew on the heart pumping especially just after you've blown up a car because obviously they get a notification they'll all be coming barreling to this location working out what kind of exit routes I could be taking from that particular area we kind of need the light to go green to be fair there we go thank you right and just progress nice and steady like I say, being in a carbon as air as well. well. What the hell's happening with the traffic? That's about the the fourth occasion now that traffic's just literally turned into me. That's outrageous, I tell you. Right, two vehicles down. We've got another three to go. I don't like the sound of those sirens. I really don't. Okay, car's in uh, relatively good shape. Uh, oh, that car in front, it looked like an exemplar turning right at the next set of traffic lights, just disappearing now. That really looked like a hunter. Whew. Right, so we've got, we've got the one at the pier, we've got the court centre. That's definitely, yeah, that's definitely one of them. Oh, heart me mouth. <laughs> oh, wow. Right, we've got Simeon's Arena and the casino. Is that, is that an NPC? Or one of them? Oh, it's a buffalo, so it's sports, so it can't be one of them. What on earth is happening? Oh, there's that hunter again. Oh, oh! Just go, just go! Don't mind me. Nothing to see here. Oh, I really want to go left, but in fact, I'm gonna quickly whiz it round left. Yeah, I don't want to go the same direction as uh, as a hunter. There's a cop shop down there, so I'll go straight up. Right, it might be worth me going for the casino. The only thing is, I'm blowing up the third vehicle, like I mentioned. It unlocks for all the hunters any NPC car. So in furnaces, 9Fs, all the rest of it, they can get those. That's just an NPC. Going out there. Um, I'm in a, a carbon as air, so it is pretty fast in a straight line. It's not the it's not the best handling car in the world, or for me it isn't. 
Um, so I don't know whether I should look for a much higher end car before I blow up the third vehicle or whether I should just stick with a carbon as a oh what should I do mind you there's nothing I can do unless there's uh, nine F's or in furnaces or felts are spawning they're the kind of cars you want you know as real getaway cars especially the Infernus although it's not got the top speed it's quite solid um, four wheel drive and yeah I find that the, the the best to drive for me for my sort of driving style right we're going to head towards the uh, casino and go for that car and if I do see a, a better car on the way I think it would be extremely prudent to change into that car from the carbon is there but I'm not seeing anything at the minute oh right okay so good so far I think we'll just uh, mosey on through uh, there's a coltic coil there, that's electric so it's quick off the line but top speed is a bit pants. Fresh wheels you got there. Hmm. Ah! Oh. Hey, NPC's wheel spinning there. That's outrageous. Oh I do love these survivor the the hunts, but uh yeah, they do get the heart racing. <laughs> oh I get so paranoid. That's not one of them. Oh wow, that was unnecessary, NPCs. Right, let's just keep on running through here. Everything's looking fine. Yeah, that's the only thing with uh, Survive the Hunt and obeying traffic laws and traffic rules, etc. It does take an inordinate amount of time to traverse the city from east to west or north to south, unless you use the, the highway system. And I should have probably used the highway, because this is... Uh, Take a lot of time, but again, it's that you know, I've had it before on Survive the Hunts where I'm waiting at traffic lights, waiting at traffic lights, and I just get impatient. Oh, that's one of them, and then I go through a red light, and uh, oh, that's one of them in an oracle, just smashing up vehicles. Uh, the light's green. Oh yeah, he's still travelling along here. Oh my god, go on, go away. Focus on someone else, not me. It's, it smashed the bonnet on the carbon azar. It does take sort of uh, car damage. Sometimes a car on my screen can look absolutely wrecked. And yet, on the hunter screen, it doesn't spawn. I'm going to just have to go. I did too. Oh, don't. Go away! I need, I'm going to have to. Oh, no. Just just go away. Just go away. Just go away. I'm going to go. I'm going to go right down here. Oh, now I've got a battered up carbon as there. So, yeah, like I was saying, it may look really battered on my screen, but sometimes it doesn't spawn on the uh, hunter's screens. This is really battered. This. I tell you what, I'm going to do. I'm going to. I'm going to look for a faster car. I'm going to speed up a little bit, take a few chances, because, yeah, it's got front and rear smashed windows. Um, well, Buffalo's not going to cut it. Not on blowing up the next vehicle. Like I say, they could be in. They'll be going straight for the fastest possible cars they can get uh, and this is definitely noticeable now both screens are gone oh. right high end vehicles they usually spawn round about here this is the sort of high end place so I am breaking all the traffic laws now because I'm in a battered car what's that uh, 
That's a uh, Baltic coil buffalo. Uh, not much at all. I need a fast car. What time are we on? Okay, we're we're sort of coming up the halfway. Right. I'm just taking chance after chance here, just hoping that those guys aren't around in this vicinity. Uh, what's that now? That's a buffalo. Nothing good spawning. Oracles. What's a Zion? Uh, oh, come on. Come on, GTA. Give me something nice. Uh, I don't go left here because that's going further into the middle of the city. And it's more likely that the uh, hunters will be there. Oh, damn. That was it. He didn't even spot me. I think it was Sam. He didn't even spot me. He was just randomly smashing into cars just to see how they'd react. Which is, you know, perfectly legit. But unfortunately, he smashed into a bloody my car. That's outrageous. I wonder if they'll... Oh, actually, sometimes in the car park down here, there are some nice cars. Uh... The only thing is that with a parked car you have to smash a window. No. Oh, absolutely sod all. Oh, I think I'm just... can't go in this car. This is absolutely dire. Right. What if I just... I'm just going to have to get into a buffalo. Oh, it's not ideal. Far from it. But... Uh, Oh, no, you're not going to steal it back, sir. I'm terribly sorry, but... Uh, no, you can't have it back. Whew. Right. Oh, I timed that right. Mind you, I seem to remember... Oh, they'll know I've swapped the car now. Is that one of them in a helicopter in the sky? Is it? Just in the distance there. I think it is, you know. Or is that just the beach one? Yeah, I'm not sure. Anyway, we're in a buffalo. We'll turn the radio off. Oof. I'm going to stand no chance uh, if I manage to blow up the next vehicle uh, with those guys. Yeah, luck will have it. I bet those guys, if I blow up the next vehicle, they'll uh, they'll have uh, infernuses immediately. It's outrageous. I'll just get a quick drink while we're parked. Right. Okay, we're definitely... I'm just going to go straight across. And try and use as much as possible the sort of back roads. I think Sam was hovering about on the main uh, the main road. Oh, that was someone parping. How rude. Right. So I think we can travel right the way along here. Okay, so we're uh, half four, wasn't it? Right, so we're a couple hours into the, into the second half. Um, we're going to have lights on in a bit. Um... Right, we need to get we need to get a bit of a move on. Is this light ever gonna change? Oh wow. Look there, see? That's what I was referring to before the build up of traffic. Look how much traffic there are. NPCs. So yeah, if a hunter sees that, immediately they think, oh get really suspicious and start like Sam was doing before, just smashing into cars. Uh, checking them out. Right, I am going to go through a, a red light. Because uh, I feel we need to make progress for the next target. Oh, uh, right, this is a red light. This is a bit more complex, this junction. He's staying there. Uh, go on. You go, you go. And I'll just go at the back of it. Thank you, sir. No parping or anything like that. Anything to draw attention to myself. 
Um, right, we can go right there, actually. Yeah, I'm going through another red light, I know. It's just time's pressing quite a bit, so I want to blow up another vehicle. Obviously, it uh, it hinders the hunters if I don't blow up vehicles um, because they've got no idea where I am. Obviously, their maps are off and all the rest of it, so they're just sort of hunting around. Um, we've got five hunters, um, so it makes it more difficult for them if I don't block vehicles. But once I do block the vehicle, then obviously they'll know exactly where it is and come barrel into that location. I feel I feel like we've done really well in this one so far. We've had that one hit off. Uh, off a hunter but I don't I think we have been incognito I think that uh, I think it was Sam looked like Sam I think he was just checking cars out and just smashing into them uh, again which is a perfectly legitimate way to to check cars out see how they react when you hit them it's just really frustrating for me because uh, obviously it creates damage on my car um, yeah right lights are on Okay, might be time to uh, wind the window down. Uh, yeah, I'll do that now. That's a window wound down. And we'll just arm a sticky bomb in readiness for the casino. Oh, I feel like deja vu along here, but I was in a lot better car then. The carbon is there, and I'm now I'm in a blinking buffalo. All right, if I do see any nice cars on the way, I am gonna, oh, I am definitely gonna change. So All right, we are starting to run out of time. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna take a chance. Yeah, nobody's reacted, so that's okay. Uh, right, there are cars coming from the right. I'm gonna take another chance. Whoa, steady, Barry. Jesus Christ. Too busy looking back. Yeah, luckily there weren't any hunters about. That was an outrageous manoeuvre, Barry. <laughs> Mind you, compared to the NPCs before, they were just turning into my lane. Oh, there's another carbon there. Oh, there's another hunter. So they are looking up and down this road. Because they'll know I'm going to go for a car. And obviously I always try and go for uh, all five cars right. We're just going to nip through here. Uh, yeah, I think we've got away with it. They have not turned back on themselves. Well, I'll tell you what we are going to do. Uh, we're going to just nip it up here. And yeah, looks clear. I don't think we've been spotted. And we're going to nip to the casino from the north side sort of travel hey, south past the end so the car is in and around the sort of entrance of the casino oh, we are getting late on time uh, I was really tempted just to undertake the, that motorbike in their uh, jeep but come on then let's, let's go oh come on What? NPCs when they do oh that is the most frustrating thing you can do. So uh, wait stop when the light's green, wait until it's sort of amber or red and then go. <laughs> right, we're just gonna go through again a red light. Just check nobody's reacted. No, right. <laughs> Right, we're coming up to... Hey, where the fuck are you? What's that car doing there? That, gee, that's not good. Was that an NPC? Right, I'm going to get... Uh, cops turn a blind eye ready. It should uh, should have cooled down by now. Why, hello, oh. how you doing? How can I help? Right, that's there. set. Enjoy. So they can't be in sports cars or supercars. Yeah. 
because I've only blown up two vehicles. Got a sticky bomb ready. I can hear the police, which is not good. Oh, that's definitely one of them. Oh. Wow. Okay. Got the sand smashing into me. Uh wow. Uh the thing is he's gonna be communicating to the rest of them. Oh, that is just spotted me. I was too busy looking back there. Is he still following me or? Oh I've got a light missing as well. Maybe as well turn the lights off. Uh we've got cars down here. Right, that's that destroyed. Right, lights out all out, I think. Oh. Right, they can get, uh, they're un unlimited now. That's been unlocked as to what cars they can get. <sighs> oh, all right. I've got a car on me already. What's that? Ah, that's it. Uh, oh. Right, probably not gonna. That's an exemplar, isn't it? Yeah. Right, I need to be extra careful around here. Duck! Right, right. Woo! Oh. Right, let's go back up to the casino. Oh! I forgot, I'm not gonna lie. I, I, I forgot that was a dead end. It <laughs> sort of turned around. Right, we need to get out of here, and we need to get motoring. So at least they got out the vehicle, which is very dangerous uh, for me. Oh, that's another one of them. Uh, however, in getting out the vehicle, because they didn't uh, manage to kill me, uh, it means I get uh, quite a bit of distance away from them. So I'm definitely thinking that I need to change vehicle, that's for sure. Because they'll have communicated out, yeah, uh, Black Buffalo, so yeah, we need that. Uh, oh, brakes, brakes, brakes. Grip, grip, grip. Well, I'm thinking, what am I thinking? Uh, we've got Simeons and uh, the arena left in terms of target vehicles. Uh, oh, there you go, sir. Oh, right. I think I've lost them, but I've, I've said that before. And uh, one of them has just sort of randomly popped up. Uh, where are we going? I'm looking for nice cars. Really fast cars, because now they can. It's absolutely un oh, unlocked for them. NPCs. Yeah, I love them. Oh, that's a coil voltage. Ooh. It's not a bad car, but yeah. uh, come on, there must be something good. So, Reen and Simeons. Now, at this stage, the hunters aren't allowed, at any stage to be fair, uh, to camp on cars. But obviously, uh, you know, I'll I'll do my utmost and do my best to uh, go for all five personal vehicles and blow them up. Um, so yeah the lightness is that it's a bit like uh, a string uh, on the the personal vehicles that are left because there's only two left uh, so that <laughs> they can't cap on them but they'll be in and around that vicinity uh, quite a lot should we say so the chances of me uh, getting in and out incognito are infinitesimal right, what's going on okay we've got sort of four and a half hours left uh, I've not got the lights on, I've got battered buffalo. They know I'm in a black buffalo, so I need to swap car. But I'm not seeing any nice vehicles. Which is really frustrating. Uh, let's run it along the highway for a bit, so at least on the highway it gives me a good chance to get away, even if they're in fast vehicles. 
so I can drop off at any point but also while searching for vehicles it's uh, a lot easier um, to search for vehicles because I want an upgrade I need an upgrade come on GTA give me a nice vehicle Well, I've got my eyes peeled for nice vehicles, but I'm just not seeing any. Uh, F620, well that's, that's not much better, than, but it's probably about the same as the Buffalo, to be fair. Oh, there's got to be some, there's got to be some nice spawns. Mind you, if I'm not getting spawns, I'm hoping that the uh, Hunters aren't getting nice spawns either. <laughs> Now that the, the uh, I've unlocked unlimited NPC cars for them in terms of uh, classes, uh, oh, I'm just not seeing anything. Well, that's not a good sign, sign. Uh, I wonder if I go across the double suspension bridge that is going towards Simeon's and the arena where the last two personal vehicles are target cars um, and it might give me a chance to swap vehicle otherwise I'm just I'm just gonna have to use this vehicle because look we're, we've only got sort of three and a half hours left I'm just gonna have to go for it if yeah if I don't see a vehicle along the double suspension bridge, I'm just going to go for the last two remaining target vehicles. Because I, I, I say I do that, because it, it's only fair that I, I try my best to do that. I mean, I, I could just sort of hide now and just travel along and, you know, it would be, it'd be sort of fairly easy to survive the hunt. Uh, what, I've only got sort of, uh, like I say, three and a quarter hours now of in-game time. But yeah, I feel it, it wouldn't be uh, fair on the hunters really. Wow, we're, we've got quite a tight squeeze here. Haven't we? Our own for a little one. Well, let's put our foot down. We have got a sticky bomb ready if we don't see another car. Uh, uh, where are you going, sir? Oh! Wow. Right, it's going to have to be a smashing grab. Uh, I'm not seeing any other vehicles. I mean, I could... Could I go in a lorry? That'd, that'd be crazy, wouldn't it? I wouldn't exactly get away, but... Uh, I don't know. That would be uh, that would be quite funny, though. Getting in a lorry. Uh, whoop. Yeah, there was no... No good cars at all, really. Right, let's... Let's go for the arena. We'll stay in the Buffalo... Uh, in fact, no, let's go for Simeon's. Have I got uh, Lester? And um, cops turn a blind eye. I've not even got my lights on, so there's no point in stopping. Hey there. What can I help you with? Uh, oh. Give me a shot when you've there. made your mind up. Right, I can always uh, get rid of the cops. Cause I'm... Right. Actually, no, we'll go Arena. Go on, sir, you go. Sticky bomb ready. So I need to be quite precise in planting this. What time on? Well, it should be on the grass somewhere over there. Yeah, it is. I've got my lights off, uh, and that is just one headlight working. Right, there's some of them over there. Tell you what, I'm just going to go for it. Right, and foot down. Ooh, pedal to the metal. Oh, that was one of them. Right, probably best to oh, get rid of the rosas. Oh. Uh, 
crust it. Call me back when you figure what? out how that brain of yours works. Why can't I get rid of the rotten? What the hell? Oh. Ooh. Why couldn't I? That's a really have they changed it in GPA. Remove Sorry. wanted level. Unavailable. Okay. Keep in touch. What? That is bizarre, right? What we got? Okay, we've got an hour and a half. We've got two stars. We've got hunters on us. Right, I'm going back on myself here, but. Uh, oh, wow. Um. I'm just thinking with, with rosas and stuff. Yeah, cop shops. Probably not the best thing, Barry. Oh, yeah, I'm getting shot at by rosas. Oh, come on. What? I don't understand why that doesn't work. Call in Leicester and just get rid of the cops. I really don't. Yeah, why, why it was saying, oh, unavailable. Oh, there's a player in the area. Yeah, there's one behind me. Whew. Oh, wow, they're sticking to me like blue. Uh, oh, I was far too late on that one, to be fair. Whew. Uh, I'm not sure what's happened to them. Yeah, they're still on me. Not turn me on. Not through. I just don't understand why I can't ring Leicester and uh, get rid of the cops. I see him. Hi. What service are you looking for? No, unavailable. I'll be keeping my eye on you. Goodbye. I don't know. It must have changed. On PS5, it must. I don't know. I've not got a clue. Right there. Ooh, they're uh, definitely catching it right. Dink a bit left, go right. Oh, I think we best chances. On the highway. Oh, that wasn't good. Duck. Quack, quack. Ooh. Oh, wow. Uh. Oh, we've got 30 minutes to, to survive. They'll be calling in everybody uh, to my location. I'm really not sure about that two stars and yeah, I just thought it'd be a case of uh, get calling Leicester and getting rid of them. Clearly not. Oh, they're really following me good. Right, we've got 20 minutes. Oh, come on, grip, grip, grip. Yeah, they're absolutely hanging on me coattails. See, they're far enough back to know the different, uh, you know. Duck! Right, right. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, actually, the cops are making it more difficult for them, I think. Oh! Right, that's it. We have managed to survive the hunt by the skin of our teeth. Oh wow, that was uh, that was pretty intense. That I'm not gonna lie. All right, guys, uh, that's it for this one. Take it easy, take care, and to talk for now. Thanks for watching. That was gumpy chasing me. I uh, hope you enjoyed it as much as a <laughs> slow clap. That's outrageous. All right, guys, take it easy. That was a really fun one. I really enjoyed that one. Really intense as usual, but uh, yeah, the chase at the end and I. I'm still not sure why I couldn't get rid of those two stars by calling Leicester. I'll have to look into it, but uh, yeah, they must have changed something on PS5. Let me know in the comments if you if you got any uh, information about it. Alright guys, ta-ta for now. Thanks for watching.